All right guys, so welcome to today's video. Today's technique is gonna be a hair color technique. Super excited to share this with you guys. I did this haircut, it's the Bob haircut with the really fun kind of point in the back. So if you haven't seen that haircut, you can check it out on YouTube. It's only a couple videos ago. So today I decided I wanted to color that mannequin uh, and really just kind of bring out the technique. So the tricky thing about coloring a Bob is the fact that it has this graduation in the back. So if you're not just doing one color, you're doing any kind of foil work you don't want to get the foils into this part of the hair uh, because it'll just look spotty so um, this technique is catered to that we follow we work with the head shape it adds this brightness in here and really pops the brightness in the face as well um, it really just brings out the haircut shape I mean if you look at it now you could see the kind of red depth that we put into it uh, and then also that brightness in the front so I'm gonna show you guys how to do it step by step I don't want to waste any more time so if you have any questions post them in the comments below if you haven't subscribed to this channel make sure you subscribe because I'm putting out videos all the time and I'd love to have you a part of this community so thank you guys so much for watching let's get started So the first thing I want to get into with this technique is the sectioning. Sectioning this off is, is kind of the most important part about the technique. Uh, I'm really just following the hairline. So this is a new um, sectioning technique that I've been playing around with because the head shape is so important and I've talked about that in a lot of videos. But also um, the hairline is really important and it plays a lot of role, uh, a big key role in the density of the hair. So I follow that hairline all the way around, create it's kind of like a square uh, section on the top. We clip that away and then I take a diagonal forward parting from, uh, from the point of that square down to behind the ear and that sections off the front of the face. So we're going to be using the Joico Blonde Life Lightener. This lifts up to nine levels. That's not what I'm going for in this technique. Really, I just want to pop the um, some highlights into the front because I'm going to overlay it with one tone. Um, but because I'm putting highlights in it, it's going to give me that depth and dimension uh, throughout the, the technique. So what I want you to notice here, I'm doing diagonal forward partings all the way up the head shape. Um, using just slices because this is a bob uh, haircut she's not going to be wearing it up i chose the the slices because it's a little bit more prominent uh, and i really wanted to kick that brightness up in the front of the hair so i take a slice i cut that in half it's a baby fine uh, uh, section or parting and then i slide the foil up underneath and i paint the uh, blonde life lightener with the 30 volume on there so I'm going to work my way up all the way around the front of the hair, all the way up to the part, and then I'm going to do the same thing on the opposite side. I'm going to speed this up so it's a little bit easier for you guys to consume, so enjoy. So you guys can see that placement, that diagonal forward placement. I'm sure you can imagine it's going to pop that brightness right in the front. And I'm going to go in with the 6RR with a dash of 4RR. This is Joico Lumashine Demi Permanent Liquid Hair Color uh, with 5 volume developer. I'm going to place that all over um, the hair. Now 
Now because we saturated our entire head with the same tone, those foils really come into play to pop just a little bit different tone into the front. So um, I wasn't trying to lift her super high, so you can see how that square falls over and that brightness sits right around her face. It changed the overall tone of her hair to more of a red tone. Uh, it just looks really rich, nice beautiful color hope you like it let me know if you have any questions in the comments below thanks for watching